Hey my GDs, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you are new, my name is Mo, I'm 28, working on my financial freedom journey. And if you're returning, hey friend. I feel like this video is a little different because I've never done something like this, but you know, why not try almost everything once? That's my little saying, I love to say. So in this video, I'm gonna go over my 2024 um, vision board. I was gonna call it a pen board, but no, my vision board. So you see, I already have some stuff cut out here this is because this was like stuff from previous years right stuff that i didn't really accomplish um i didn't get me a camera i mean am i ambitious yes but am i gonna stop i'm not so i have a million dollar little big bill it's not little here um just some fashion because like i am a sweat and lazy girl so i just you know want to do better with that um my curls i want them bigger and i like this and then journey to 1 million again ambitions ambitions so 1 million youtube subscribers so these are some other pictures that i went ahead and printed off that aligns with my goals um my personal goals my finance goals all types of goals for the year 2024 um and then i also have some more pictures so what i'm going to do first is go ahead and cut this up and then we're going to go ahead and place it on our vision board so i hope you enjoy this make sure you guys like this video if you like it if you enjoy this content um and if you want to see other stuff let me know and go ahead and subscribe to this youtube channel so let's get into it Okay, so I went ahead and cut out all the pictures with some other ones, and I'm not gonna explain them to you, but I'm gonna explain them to y'all while I put them on the board, darling. So let's pull out the board. So this is the board that we're using. If you're like, girl, where'd you get it from? I definitely got this from Walmart, okay? And if you ask me how much, I wanna say, but no more than 15, but I'm a little bit sure I'm a little closer to 10 because <laughs> I don't recall it because it's kind of been a little while. It's just been a, like, been a, it's been a few weeks, if I'm being honest. It's been a couple of weeks since I actually bought it. Probably like, girl, why'd you wait so long to do your um, vision board? Because I was going to do it sooner, but my husband wanted to do his vision board where I did mine. Um, even though he knew I was going to record it and he was like, oh, let's record it together. Did that happen? No, it did not happen, darling. But that's okay. Here we are now. So I'm just gonna take the back. So I like doing a picture frame. Me personally, I feel like um so previous years, right? I used to get us picture frames for our vision boards, but I used to get like really huge ones and I would put it in the living room or in the den area. And it made me uncomfortable, which I know this is gonna be like what? Um because I'm on YouTube, but let me explain. It made me a little uncomfortable sharing it with like anytime people would come to our home or whatever. Cause sometimes they would ask questions like, oh, you're on YouTube? Cause I mean, most people who know me don't even know that I, I have a YouTube, right? And mostly when I do my vision board, it has like YouTube content on there or something, you know, related. But yeah, I would just get like these questions, uh-oh. I would get these questions and concerns and I don't want to be questioned on like my goals and stuff, you know? I'm just not the one. I don't like that, me personally, on a molecular level, okay? So that's why I got this like a littler one. Can I say a littler? <laughs> a smaller one. And this is gonna, gonna, this is gonna just go in our, um, our bedroom. Um, so he has one the same size and I have one this size. So we can put it on each side of the bedroom and we can see our goals every day. That's why I got it smaller. So this is the part I think I'm a, I always get a little nervous about because 
the placements. I just want them to be placed very well. I should have got some glue. I didn't. But I got tape that's dirty and old. And I got some um, stickies with Sharpie because there's some things I want to write as I go along. So um, I never have to worry about finances. Y'all get the vibes. Like, y'all, this is my budgeting channel. Do you understand? Like, I'm not trying to be worried about no money, honey. So, yeah, I like that. Um, I got this beautiful black girl because your girl's trying to clear up her skin, okay? She's trying to do better outside. She's trying to be just better overall with the clear skin. I doubt you can see the whole thing. So, let me just turn it sideways a little bit. Okay. Then we have, like, vacation spots. Let me and my husband and then again i told you guys we're having a wedding next year so i just want it to be beautiful and feel seen i guess so that's what this is for taking care of yourself is productive i don't know about y'all but i definitely am one of those people who feel a little guilty sometimes like if i don't do anything that whole day but just like sleep even though i probably needed the sleep or um I don't know just worry about me get my nails done or something i feel bad and so i feel like my therapist not i feel like my therapist is like listen girl take care of yourself and i i want that so this one is just talking about joy joy it's a now gladness not based on circumstances mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. i love that i don't know where i want to put it though let's put it right here so i am a we're gonna say flexitarian <laughs> mostly a pescatarian but every now and then depending on holidays i might i'm not gonna lie to y'all i might eat some meat i just gotta be honest so with that being said that's why i have these grains and vegetables right here okay two thousand dollars every month i kind of want to section it all two thousand dollars every month is basically me talking about side hustles so if y'all don't know my husband and i we also have vending machines or we have a vending machine and we want that to you know acquire some goodness as well as youtube i would like youtube to you know tap 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 in so hashtag journey to a million subscribers i mean what what is life if i'm not dreaming i am trying to work towards it though i'm not just dreaming though so i think i'm gonna put money stuff right here and then like this is for hair this is for skin I feel like when it comes to food, hair, and skin, and then this is a work working out, definitely the vibes. So I want to get back into just like reading a whole bunch of books. So this is why I have this book. And then coziness. You guys like see all the aesthetic stuff. It's so cute. I'm not going to lie. It's so cute. My mom, she lives for aesthetics in her house. <laughs> and shout out to her. But when it comes to me, I don't want to be aesthetically pleasing. I just want to be comfortable. Like I want to be comfortable in my own space. You know, do do the I the vibes are cute. Don't get me wrong. The vibes are definitely cute. I I just don't want them. Okay, and then this one is anxiety because your girl has anxiety. I am not self-diagnosed. Like I said, I talk and I go to therapy all the time. So it's just talking about 10 best hobbies for um, people with anxiety to help you calm down your anxiety instantly. Oh my gosh, I love this. I found this on Pinterest. Um, so yeah, it just talks about writing, listening to music, reading books, connecting with animals, going for walks, dancing in your home, cook enjoyable meals, going to yoga, create beautiful pictures, and watch inspiring movies love this i feel like maybe this 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 is like self-care vibes pay off your student <laughs> it's a candle but it says pay off your student loans this is definitely money vibes maybe i'm putting stuff to let's just just sanction everything to like where it needs to go this is also self-care vibes says 10 habits for a healthy life eight hours sleep 10 minutes of meditation 15 minutes of yoga and stretching 30 minutes exercise three days of cardio a week, 30 minute reading, 30 minutes fresh air and sun, three gratitudes every day, half a plate of fruits or veggies and 2.7 liters of water. Can I say reading that made me overwhelmed? I have to be honest. And so this is also trips and vacations. This is for me, funded, money. I don't know, I feel like camera is money wise. Okay, so we have money here. 
this is like all self me get my life together including food i don't know i feel like food can go in between this and health this is health money myself this is like me and my boo traveling joy with us yeah and then here we have reading and being cozy so let's just now that everything is explained let's just try to organize this in some type of way Okay, so this is what I ended up doing. I did not include some of the pictures because it is a smaller board and I wanted to get to the nitty and the gritty. You see the um, money here at the bottom, million dollars, million dollar, um, not million dollar, the million YouTube subscribers. I feel like that's in money range as well. First of all, I'm talking about finances on my YouTube channel. And two, um, with subscribers and views comes money. Let's just call it spade a spade. I also put in the um, YouTube award that they give once you reached a certain amount i think it's a hundred thousand subscribers something like that um as well as the camera because that also has to do with money in my mind because it has to do with youtube two thousand dollars every month again that's side hustle 
So the fully funded is for my 401k and IRA. And then I have here, husband and wife, bring in six figures, $100,000 plus each, right? And I have that on stacks. And then I never have to worry about finances. That's the money area. It's kind of a lot. Oh, and then pay off student loans. Yum. It's some loud noise in the background. But um, health and self-care a little bit. Taking care of yourself is productive. The anxiety. 10 habits to do every day. Eating good. My joy. Reading books. Um, I had this girl for hair, but I didn't have space. <laughs> so I got her. And first of all, the hair is just beautiful okay and then the skin is skinny as well as that skin so it's like okay i'm putting it out there that my skin needs to be skinny i like this cozy for the home one because i want my home to be cozy but two the plants i love plants can i be successful and allow them to live is the question but we're working on it you guys know about the books so then we also have vacation 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 um maybe vacation vacation adventure a little bit with the hot air balloons just do something different and i put that in the husband realm because i want us to do that together enjoy those experiences and share them as well as have the joy so yes this is what i feel like i want my 2024 to look like this is my um vision board i'm gonna go ahead and frame it and that's all that i have for you guys i hope you guys created a 2024 vision board